Hi, my name is Tola Kay, and I'm the author of the best-selling Survival Guide series, which is available on Amazon, Barnes and & Noble, and iBooks. And this is the 14th in a series of instructional films. Today we're going to be looking at the Nook tablet here, and I'm just going to give you a quick video of how to create a Barnes & Noble account right from your Nook tablet. So when you take it right out of the box and turn it on, you're going to see the screen right here. And you can play this video, which will give you just a few quick tips on getting started. Or you can touch skip video, which is what we're going to do. And you're going to see the terms and conditions. And once you're satisfied here, you're going to touch the agree button. And then you're going to want to enter your time zone, so I'm in Eastern time here. And touch the next button. And now it's going to try to find a Wi-Fi network. Now, in order to create a Barnes & Noble account from your Nook tablet, you're going to need a Wi-Fi network in the vicinity, so just make sure you have one in your home. So I'm going to connect to this one at the top here. And I'm going to enter the password. And once I've entered the password, I'm going to touch the Connect button. And once it's connected, this button will appear at the bottom, Continue with Setup. And that's what we're going to touch. Now I'll ask you to log in with your Barnes & Noble account. Now, since you don't have one, we're going to touch this arrow at the bottom right next to or create a new account if you don't already have one. And this is going to have you enter your name, your email, password, and a security question. So let's do that. And once you're done entering all of that information, you're going to touch the Submit button and your Barnes & Noble account has been created. Now touch OK. And here you'll have the option of entering a credit card number and you can skip that for now or you can do it now either way. Touch the skip button and then touch don't add credit card if you want to skip it. And you're ready to go with your Nook tablet and you have a Barnes & Noble account. So you can now press the Nook button and then touch home. Now I'd just like to give you one more tip. If you want to give the Nook tablet to somebody else or if you have a, another Barnes & Noble account yourself, you can actually deregister this device, erase it, and then register with a different Barnes & Noble account. You can't add two Barnes & Noble accounts at the same time. To deregister, I'm going to press the Nook button and then touch Settings. And then touch Device Info at the top here. Touch Erase and Deregister Device. And then touch the Erase and Deregister Device button. And now before you confirm here, this is the last confirmation screen, Make sure that you do want to do this. This will erase any ebooks, documents, pictures, anything that's not backed up on a micro SD card or on your computer. So once you're sure that you want to do that, touch the reset Nook button and your Nook tablet will be deregistered and you'll be able to re-register with a different Barnes & Noble account. And that is how you create a Barnes & Noble account and deregister your Nook tablet. And if you have any questions or comments, don't hesitate to post them in the comments section or purchase the Nook Tablet Survival Guide or any other survival guide. And I do apologize for the flickering of the screen here in the video. It's just the nature of the screen as you noticed in my other videos for the iPad for instance, this does not happen. Uh, it is just the nature of the Nook Tablet screen. Uh, so thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.